All right, so after you download this app called Lime, um, it told me where the bikes were and it says scan to ride. So watch trees. Looks like you just take a picture of this code and now it's asking me for payment information. You can do Apple Pay. Looks like it's a dollar to start the ride. Kick start to get it to speed, okay? And then it's telling us to ride with a helmet if you can. Park with care. Don't forget to lock up. You end your trip by pressing the lock button on your app. That's important. All right, well it looks like we're ready to go. All right, now it's activated and this kind of made a little song and it's showing that we're ready to go. And I guess, pick up the, learn how to ride a scooter again. Press, go. <laughs> Don't do it yet, it's not going. How do you, it's not going when you press. Press go. It's not doing anything. Is it supposed to go by itself? All right, so when I first got on, it wasn't going anywhere, but then I read the instructions and you kind of have to kickstart yourself to go. And let's try this. quick and you have a break just like on a scooter. Find the break. Yeah, so works pretty well. But see, when you're here and you just push go, it won't go anywhere. So you do have to kick start yourself. And then it takes off. So it seems pretty simple to ride. Just get the app beforehand. Make sure you load in your credit card information beforehand and um, make sure you're wearing a helmet if possible and appropriate shoes. So I'm just gonna go ahead and park mine where I got it, but you can leave it anywhere around town. I think the most important thing is just to make sure when you're finished that you go back to your app and click that you're finished. Um, lock. End your ride, yes. Um, take a photo of where you parked your lime to help the next rider find it. So, I guess we'll do that. And it made a noise again, and we're done.